Hi everyone, Richard here with a Google Classroom tutorial. This actually combines a little bit of Google Apps Script as well. So in reading a recent post in a forum that I belong to, the question was asked, is it possible to continually post and repost writing prompts to the same Google Doc for students. So in other words, if you want to maintain a semester long or a year long writing journal um, and you yourself as the teacher want to put in the writing prompts, is this possible? And uh, yes, it's actually quite easy to do um, with using a combination of Google Classroom and Google Apps Script. So here's how it works. Um, the first thing I need to do is create the semester writing journal template. So I simply opened a blank Google Doc and named it. And that was it. Piece of cake. So now that my template has been created, I can actually just close that. I go back to my Google Classroom. And this is a small classroom of just three students. Um, it could be much larger. Um, the concept will apply in very large classrooms as well. So I'm going to go to my stream and I'm going to click the plus button, create assignment, and this is going to be a semester writing journal collection. Okay. It's not going to have a due date. I could actually give more instructions about what the students will find here. Um, so a new writing prompt will be posted each week. And I'm going to go ahead and grab that template I created. Here it is, the semester writing journal. Let's go ahead and add that. And I want to make sure each copy or each student gets a copy of this writing journal. So I'm going to select make a copy for each student. Now when I assign this, it puts all those documents into one folder, which makes it very easy to find those documents uh, with Google Apps Script and to find all of them. So I'm going to assign it and as it's doing it, we'll head back over to that classroom folder. In this case, I'm in a course called Google Classroom Training Section 1. Yeah, so the folder has arrived, Semester Writing Journal Collection. Now inside of that folder are all of my student journals. And again, there's nothing in here because um, I haven't pushed out any of the writing prompts. So as you can see, I'm putting out the prompts separate from the actual um, separate from Google Classroom. I'm not using Classroom to distribute the prompts, just to distribute the template. To distribute the prompts, I'm going to use a Google Sheet with a custom Google App Script that I'll be sharing. So, but before I can actually execute that script, um, I will be needing the folder ID of this particular um, assignment, right? the semester writing journal collection. And the folder ID is located right here in the URL. It's the trailing characters all the way to the end. So all of this is the folder ID. The script will need this to be able to find all of these documents and add the new writing prompts. And not only will it add the writing prompts, but it'll create a new page per prompt. So we're basically building a digital book of writing in one Google Doc. So I, I copied that uh, folder ID. I'm now going to go into the custom uh, Google Apps Script that's a part of this Google Sheet. So I went to Tools. I can show you this, just Tools, Script Editor. And I, I, I wrote this script right here. And I'm going to paste in my Google Classroom assignment folder right there, just the folder ID, and save. 
Now, the first time you run this, you'll be asked to authorize the script. You can go ahead and do that. I've already done that, so that's not going to pop up when I do this. Um, and the final step is simply to, in my Google Sheet, in column A, is just to start writing my prompts. So if I could say, if I were invisible, I would dot, dot, dot. And if I, now if I go over to writing prompts and distribute, all of these documents are going to get that prompt. So let's just go ahead and open these up, all of them. So this is student 10, that's student 20, who are we missing? All right, student 1. So I have all these documents open. I have my prompt. I'm going to click distribute prompts. So I'm going to do this, and you can see how fast it is. It's done. I've handed out the new prompt to all of the students. If I open up their journals, they all see it. Okay. So let's do another one. My favorite color is... Not very creative here. distribute prompts. And just like that, all of my students now have another page called My Favorite Color Is. So everyone is getting another one. And just for good measure, um, zebras are an interesting animal because, and I'm going to go up here and say distribute prompts, and as expected, we have another new page about zebras in all of the documents. So again, just to reiterate, this is demonstrating how you can push out writing prompts per page um, via Google Apps Script um, and one simple Google Sheet. So I hope you uh, like the solution to this question and um, you could probably further develop this to insert a timestamp to know exactly when you pushed out the writing prompt. So if you wanted to come back and assess it later, you could see that, oh, I pushed this out on such and such a day, so on and so forth. So this is just something to play with, but um, I thought it was something worth sharing. So thanks for watching. Bye.